Was fantastic interest on social media about the amazing transformation that you went through over the last, say, couple of years. And from what I see, it looked like 50 kilos uh, of extra weight taken off your body, and you got a ton of mass uh, that you've built up. You Can you just briefly, how did you do that? Um, I mean, it was a, a change in diet, was a, was a big one, obviously. Um, trying to clean the diet up a little bit. But also on top of that, I stopped drinking any alcohol for nearly a year now. And um, that had a big, big, um, big effect. I think people don't realize perhaps that how many calories they're consuming through nights out and socializing and everything else. You sort of tend to forget about that, but that was a big change for me. And then also with my training, I changed, tried to change the intensity in my weight sessions. They didn't really change the structure that much, but I, I tried to up the intensity, but then I also added in a lot of HIIT training. So a lot of interval training. I found that's really been beneficial for me to, to drop the fat and also although I have lost some muscle in the process and I've lost some strength it, it hit training you do tend to hold on to a lot more muscle than doing hours upon hours of cardio so I mean if anyone is looking to lose weight and try and keep as much muscle as they can for me I think hits the best way to go about it and plus also it's 15 20 minutes of your time rather than doing an hour on the treadmill or whatever my, my lifestyle has changed in a very big way as well as the training, the diet and everything else. Okay, now, right down to brass tacks, I've already hit you with a pretty tough question there. And uh, social media, everybody really wants to know, because you've got a ton of potential, are you going to do bodybuilding at some point in time? Is Kate encouraging you to, to chisel even more and build and pose and hit the stage? And, yeah. You know, Tell us about that. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's, it's definitely will happen at some point. I mean, right now, obviously, I'm, I've, I need to get back from here. It's not gone particularly well at World's Strongest Man. I need to get back. My body's in a much better place now. Physically, I feel much better, feel much healthier. I've now got to knuckle down and get back to performing as I used to in a, in a much smaller frame, which, you know, I still believe is achievable. I think with, with some hard work and over the next six months, I can make some drastic improvements. But that's obviously first priority. In, in the future, I mean, um, yeah, definitely at some point I will get on a bodybuilding stage. Um, more as much as anything, because I like to test myself, I like to challenge myself. And for me, someone who's always been a bit of a fatty and loved his food and loved his beer and everything else, for me to then get on stage and be in, in, in stage condition would be a, a real challenge. And, you know, I feel that's something that, you know, I, I'd, I'd learn a lot about myself from. and. You know, I like to sort of try and test myself and, and do things that, I, you know, people wouldn't think I'm capable of. Well, there's been a lot of wonderful, uh, can I say, great British bodybuilders, strongmen uh, in the past. Gary Taylor, uh, Eddie Elwood, the list goes on and on. And uh, you are, are one of them. And to, to follow in their footsteps in bodybuilding, I think, would be amazing. And people are really impressed with you. And as I am, and I just want to tell you that you're a fantastic example of strongman. Oh, thank and, you. And an Englishman and a fine gentleman, and really a, a great, you know, promoter of sport and the physical culture for many young people. I just want to say keep it up and thank you for all your effort. No, thank you very much. And um, yeah, I mean, for me, obviously, the strongman is, is a big part of my life and it's the priority. But, you know, I've got to a point in life where feeling healthy, feeling fitter and feeling better within myself is just as important as that and you know it's nice that I've made the changes and I do honestly feel like I'll reap the rewards in terms of in my strongman career later in the year maybe beginning of next year and that's that's what I'm aiming towards right now. Well looking forward to it keep it up. Thanks Bill.